welcome back everybody to Colorado Lunkers. Adam and I are going out uh, dove hunting and sparrow hunting again this evening. Uh, we're not really dressed for it. You know, Adidas, and he has a bright blue shirt on. But we just got off work, so you, you got you to gotta do what we got to do, you know. So, uh, yeah, we're heading out to the property. And uh, we'll see you guys there. We showed up at the spot. The sun's in our eyes because we got here at almost the perfect time. Uh, there's signs of doves here. So hopefully we can get a get a dove or two and do a catch and cook. So I just got into uh, my sit. I don't know if Adam's going to come sit with me or what. Um, right under these trees where we sat yesterday and uh, popped that other bird. Hopefully, hopefully something comes in. From what it sounds like, guys, there's some people on the trail down here. I'm gonna keep a low profile. And hopefully, uh, they don't see me, and uh, they push some uh, doves our way. Uh, but honestly, I'm out here for sparrows because they're a pest. Doves would be cool to get to, just so we can do a ke catch and cook. But uh, if I'm gonna be honest, I don't know if we're gonna get any doves. So uh, I'm gonna sit here for a little bit longer. Well, a lot longer, probably till light shooting light ends and uh, see what we can get so guys you may be wondering uh why are we hunting with bb guns again well you know they're they're quiet uh and out here we kind of we kind of got to keep a low profile uh, it really helps out with uh with hunting here you know um there's some doves around here somewhere I hear them, but it's just it's just because of low profile. Yeah, it makes it a little bit harder. It's a little old school, but it's the best. It's the best way we found to hunt them here. Now, what we've tried before is with 12 gauge, and uh, it just makes way too much noise, and then they don't come back. And I just heard a shot from Adam, so maybe he got something. But what I'm using is my first ever BB gun. I got way back in the day. It's a Daisy pump and uh it works great out here hopefully uh we can get the job done with it today so ladies and gentlemen i just found adam he's over to my right i don't know if he's gotten anything so uh, we're gonna walk over there and see uh, see what he's been getting done. So, have you uh, made any shots yet? I made two down here, but okay. they were uh, sparrows. Sparrows, yeah. Sparrows. Trying, trying to take these birds off this lady's property. Yeah. Uh, and get did you uh, down any? Did not. Cool. Uh, I'm I'm still trying to get the hang of this new gun here. Uh, so today Adam's using a uh, points uh, 177 uh, Pelagon. It's pretty nice. Uh, he's trying to get the hang of the sights right now. They're uh, pneumatic sights, I think they're called. Yeah. So uh, he's getting the hang of that. I told you what I was using, and uh, I haven't gotten anything. So uh, we're gonna sit out here till shooting light is. So Adam and I both just took a shot on a starling. Uh, we both missed. It was a little bit far. Uh, we were just walking back to the truck to go get a, a pallet so we can uh, make a blind right quick. And uh, he landed on the tree, so hopefully some more come back, and it's it's a really good sign that they're they're in these trees. We've sat here for uh, quite a while, so I think I'm gonna switch up what I'm doing and start building my blind. So uh, see you guys over where I'm gonna build this blind. So as I'm starting to pull the pallet out of my truck to make the blind, Adam turns the corner, and he's got one. I don't know where he got it from, but he got one. Uh, Oh yeah, I am so pretty close to where I am, but uh, I'm gonna start building this blind. It's a lot of work to 
build a blind, this blind on my own. I'm not that big of a, of a guy. So uh, it takes a lot, a lot to do this. So I only built half the blind. I only got the pallet set and the uh, floor set. I still need to do the walls, but I decided that I'm a semi attempt to use this blind in the state it is to try getting a bird. So I just heard one of Adam's shots go off. I'm not sure if he got one. Hopefully he did. Uh, whoa. Um, hopefully, uh, if he did, he comes over here and shows us what he got. I barely missed him. He was a, a sparrow and uh, barely missed him. So uh, hunting time. It's about to end and it's been really slow. So I think I'm gonna end the video here. Thank you guys for watching. Go follow Colorado Lunkers on Instagram and I'll see you guys in the next one.